All right, so I'm back again today, and today I'm gonna to show you two more exercises that you're gonna do every day for the next week. Today we're gonna to start with the roll over, and then we're gonna move on into the double leg stretch. Both great exercises and totally different. You'll get a different ab burn, but you'll also get a nice stretch, which is what I like too, and it's a, it's a nice part of this. So I'm just gonna move all the way to the end of my frame here so you can see what's going on. And for the rollover, I'm going to start nice and flat on my back here. And I'm going to take my legs up into tabletop position. Remember, when we do tabletop position, you don't want your body shifting. So you're really going to focus on engaging the abdominals because they're your support system. You're going to bring both legs together. We're going to stretch them out. And you're going to think of squeezing those inner thighs together. We're going to inhale. We're going to start to take the legs up towards 90, towards the ceiling. And now I'm going to slowly peel my legs up and over my head like this. And I'm not collapsing everything. Let's just keep it nice and controlled today. I'm going to move my legs about hip distance apart, flex my feet here so I get a nice stretch through my hamstrings. And I'm going to roll back down. And I'm really focusing on going nice and slow. I'm really controlling the movement. I'm staying in the very center of my spine. And nothing's happening up in my shoulders. Notice they're staying nice and relaxed. I'm going to point my toes. I'm going to bring my legs back together. Let's do this one again. And again, you're just going to exhale. You know, you want to exhale on your exertion, on the hard part. I'm taking my legs over here. I'm going to open them again. Nice and relaxed. And I'm not putting a lot of pressure into the floor with my arms either. So, uh, you know, obviously they're here for balance, but I'm not like gripping for dear life. Flexing my feet and rolling back down. Nice and controlled. If there's a one little moment you'll probably find that's a little tough and your shoulders will want to pop up so you want to really focus on lengthening them down the back point my toes and bring my legs together and your goal here is to do let's say 12 of these now for the double leg stretch let me just move over slightly here so same thing we're going to start with the legs in tabletop position feels like every exercise right bring my legs together my hands are going to be by the sides of my knees this exercise can be done with your head on the ground. Again, if it really bothers your neck, just do that. It's fine. Don't struggle. Don't kill yourself. It's not worth it. I'll show you what it looks like with the head up, though. We're going to take a breath in. On the exhale, I'm just dropping my chin ever so slightly, gazes over my knees, and I'm curling my head up here. Now, on my inhale, what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring my hands by the sides of my ears, and I'm going to lengthen my legs out. I'm gonna circle my arms around without hitting a bookshelf and coming back in. And again, inhale and exhale around. Inhale, nice and long, abdominals stay flat, body stays long and back. If you're doing it on the ground, you know, it looks like this, that's fine. You can also take your legs a little bit lower, not a problem. Uh, anything like that, any little modifications that you do need to do to make it easier, totally cool with that you go for it just as long as those abdominals are working so i want to see about 12 of those as well and i promise you'll feel them you're going to do uh 10 roll 12 rollovers sorry and 12 double leg stretch you're going to do that for the next week get back to me let me know how it feels uh just remember really easy through the neck nobody's hurting themselves here uh, if you need any more tips and tricks please visit styleontheside.com or even drop me a line, ask a question, or leave a comment, and I will get back to you ASAP. Have a great day.